What are you looking at, punk? Hey, you don't want to hurt me, right? Chump hunting. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Shall we get started then? And please, no talking. It's funny, Jimmy. No, it's not. Jimmy, it's really funny. Chill out, man. Jimmy, I need to talk to you about something. Not now, Pete. I'm basking in adulation. I mean, running the school fairly. Dude, so fairly. No, Jimmy, please. Pete, enough. Yeah, shut up, Pete. The court hey, must on. know they're king. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Jimmy? Forget the school. The whole town should know about you. You're like... The mayor. You should leave your mark on City Hall! Yeah, <laughs> dude! Take a dump on the doorstep! <laughs> no, you homunculus! Not a dump! It's something much more elegant. Paint a warning. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll show everyone who's boss! That's right, Jimmy. Alright, you girls wait here. This is gonna be something they'll never forget. Wait, Jimmy, don't forget about Gary! Wait, wait for me! Thank you. 
I help you find any? Thank you for shopping at Yum Yum.
I did it! That's great. Listen, we've got a problem. I'm the king, Petey, the king! Whatever, you're a king with a load of problems. I've only been gone a couple hours, what could have happened? All kinds of things. You remember that promise you made about restoring law and order and improving the school? Let's just say it ain't exactly coming true. Well, if anyone wants a fight, I'm right here. I think Gary must be behind it, but trust me, everyone wants a fight. Listen, I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. Oh, man.
Come here, boy! Hey, what's oh. up, Mr. Burton? What's up? Oh, what's up? My gym oh. is up in flames! Look! Damn, how'd that happen? As if you don't know! You're a degenerate! The think I trusted you! It wasn't me! Yeah, I'm no saint, but I tried to bring order to the school to stop the bullying. Ha! <laughs> bullying? I don't care about bullying! In fact, I encourage bullying! That's right! Builds moral fiber! Makes men! Yeah! Cause you didn't make the team. You had to ruin it for everyone. Yeah, you bully! You're a pig! You ruined my life! What are you talking about? I never wanted to be on the team. You like to torment weak kids, and you've got the personality of a jockstrap. Yeah, well, I call the police. You'll be killed for this, my boy. It wasn't me. You're done for, Hopkins. Help. What? Who was that? It's Yuri. Oh There's people trapped inside. Oh, I'm really scared, Mommy! Man, you guys are pathetic. I'll get him. Where's the fire extinguisher? By the stairs next to the locker room. But don't think I've forgiven you, Hopkins. Ow! I'm getting out of here! Ah! I'm stuck!
Hopkins comes through. should be eating a full breakfast before class and getting at least eight hours rest.
That's an unpleasant little sound. Jimmy, you've interrupted me. Oh, sorry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Can I see? Sure, take a look. I think I have finally caught the essence of what it means to be a banana. I really feel my work is moving forward. Uh, here's the thing. Art is lost on me. I've always been more into music. You know, having thoughts for another really makes your work glow. Uh, how do you mean? When people do things, incredible things, when people blossom and grow, that really moves me. You know what I mean? Not really. <laughs> I am in love, Jimmy. And I want to make tonight very special. Would you mind going to collect a few things while I work my muse out? A dress, some perfume, my pearl necklace from the jeweler is not too much. I must look my best tonight. Tonight? Wow. Of course. Is this legal? Of course it's legal. Whatever can you mean? Now go on, my dear. Hurry!
now. Try the new Aquaberry vest. You're getting oh, oh, yeah. oh, the you Not too bad. Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, what took you so long? Thanks. No problem. Oh, man, I can't believe this. My first time with a teacher. Oh, man, this is gonna be great. Hey, Jimmy, what are you doing here? Nothing. What are you doing here? Ah, uh, well, it's a little awkward, but since you've been such a good friend to me, Ms. Phillips, she's asked me, me, of all people, she, can you believe? She's asked me on a date. Wait. She asked you? I think you're mistaken. Uh, what? Yeah, I mean, I think there's been some sort of mistake. You sure you haven't been hitting the bottle again? No. I mean, yes, I am sure. Well, okay then. Hitting the bottle. <sighs> Lionel, you came. You look great. So do you, Deirdre. Thank you. Wait, what? Jimmy, what are you still doing here? Uh, what do you mean? This boy is an angel. He's been magnificent. Uh -huh. And he is so cute. Cute. <laughs> nice. Come on, Lionel. Let's go. Bye, Jimmy. Jimmy, you should get back to school. Wait, Miss Phillips. Ah, oh, man.
parents are totally stressing me out. I worry about disappointing them. Don't mess with Sartan, the mighty needs some help of yours. You look Unleash like my idiot. barbarian rage. Okay, now I'll... it's because I hate you. Um, I gotta go call my mommy. What? No, it isn't. What are you guys talking about? Uh, the uh, library uh, is full uh, of rats! Uh, and uh, I've got my pre-pre-pre-med test next week, amigo! <sighs> You're such a lame old... Uh, Some king you turned out to be! Oh, how I long for the old days! Sure, we were laughed at and mercilessly bullied by everyone, but at least you could study without fear of rodents coming near us! Get uh, <laughs> oh, off! Oh, did you piss yourself again, Algie? Ew. No, oh, I swear. Algie. I spilled soda on myself. Soda. Oh. Right. What a bunch of sissies. Well, I'm not afraid of a few rats. Jeez, pathetic.
in there. These crates? Yes, those crates. The rats appeared once those books were delivered. Everything seems to be fine, miss. I think I got them all. Thank you, Jimmy. If you have any late fees, I think we can just forget about them. I did that a long time ago. I, I mean, thank you, miss. <laughs> You can count on Jimmy. Can you afford to skip school? You are not my child, so I don't care, but... Stop skipping class. Just drop out. Nice guy. Trust me. How you doing? I got this for you. This is so sweet. I like being alone with you. Hey. Once a day, you'll live longer. You have nice lips. I can't wait to graduate so I can do that all the time. I was looking over your last assignments, and some of you have real talent. It was really a treat.
Hey, sweet cheeks. I like you, Jimmy, but I probably shouldn't, you know. sensitive side. That's right! Glad that's done. I really, need to get better I really, really, really need some help.
Hey, Miss Phillips. Hey, Jimmy. So what really happened to Mr. Galloway? Where did he go? It's a sad story, but... Sometimes when grown-ups get upset, they respond in the wrong ways and, well... Small problems get bigger and that's really the thing about being an adult. Miss, I'm not five. My mom's been married five times and I've been expelled from seven schools. <laughs> yeah. He's a drunk. Stupid man couldn't control himself. Damn him! I love him. But that wretched ogre Hattrick guilt-tripped him into committing himself into the asylum to get dried out. If only someone could get in there and tell him to get out, I'll take care of him. Why don't you go? Because that loveless scumbag Hattrick told him not to let me in, said I was a bad influence. Don't you worry, miss. I'll get him out. Okay. Meet me near the asylum tonight. I'll be there. And Jimmy? Yes, Miss Phillips? It's Ms, not Miss. Oh, right. leave stuff lying around everywhere.
Jimmy, I'm glad you made it. Please hurry and try to talk some sense into him. I'll be waiting for him at the asylum gates. Don't worry, miss. Thank you so much.
I must be a better person. I must be a better person. I must be a better person. Oh, God! I am pathetic! Hey, Mr. Galloway. Go away! I don't want to have another group therapy session with those people. If I have to pretend to be someone's mother one more time, I'll... Oh. Hi, Jimmy. Uh, what on earth are you doing here? Ms. Phillips sent me. She's really worried about you. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> I can't right now, Jimmy. I'm late for my regression therapy as it is. It's fantastic. I've discovered I really do hate myself. Patrick was right. I am a loser. No, you're not. Don't be ridiculous. Come on, we can't let bullies like Mr. Hattrick win. Okay, Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy, I really appreciate this. And Me too. I am so happy to have my galley bear back. Galley bear? <laughs> I should teach lessons you or something. You might be able to help me. Balloons all got out. Can you help me get them back?
Hey there. Hey! Mr. Galloway, should you really be doing that? Oh, Jimmy. No, I suppose not, but life is unfair. You promised Ms. Phillips. Oh, God. What kind of world do we live in where I get punished for a minor indiscretion and Hattrick gets away with taking bribes from his pupils? He does? Yes. He sells advanced copies of tests to the sons of his rich friends and nobody says a word. Wait, what rich friends? Well... Darby Harrington, for one. I can't believe he's selling tests. What if I got evidence of him doing this? <laughs> then I'd never need to drink again. All right, let me see what I can do. Sure hope he shows up. I need to get my grade up. Don't worry, he'll be here soon, I'm sure. Greetings. Did you chaps bring the money? Yeah. Do you have the test?
I told you I'd bring you down. While it's true you may never use what's taught in my class, that doesn't give you the right to play hooky.
You're not even trying, are you? You can do better than that! Yes? Anything new? You fought the law, and the law won. While it's true you may never use what's taught in my class, that doesn't give you the right to play hooky. Wrong. Pathetic. There was never any doubt. Are you inbred or just no teeth? Suppose you want to train again? That'll do. You ready to train? There's a special way to grab someone's head to punch your fucking shoulder. I gotta 
don't mess with my project. <laughs> Take this. Well, where'd he go then, you tramp? Oh, you call in a tramp! I loved Johnny. Not exclusively, I'll grant you, but I loved him! Now he's gone! Hey, what's <laughs> going on? Johnny's disappeared, gone crazy, abducted by aliens! I bet it was you, Hopkins! Yeah, 
Since you turned up, everything's gone really weird. King of the school. Who's the daddy-o now, huh? My love has gone. Find him, King. Quit poking me. You're both acting crazy. Cut it out. Now tell me, where's Johnny? <sighs> I don't know. Nobody's seen him. He got a little brokenhearted after we split up, but it's not my fault. Someone said they saw a couple of asylum orderlies driving up to his house. But you know how people love to talk. Johnny wasn't crazy. Asylum orderlies? He was a real leader. Not like you, Jimmy. Look, I'll get your boy back, all right? See you later, freaks.
but he sure does yell a lot, huh? Thanks for getting me out, Jimmy. How'd you get in there to begin with? Some of the local kids said they'd gotten together with Lola. I went a little crazy. I can believe that. Yeah, anyway, so I gotta find Lola, see if it's true or not. See ya. All right, Johnny. Have fun. <laughs>
gotta stop spilling. Pretty cool game. It's all about killing things and taking their stuff. What was it called? Grottos and gremlins or something like that? Yeah. Hey, what are you doing in here? I'm here to beat you up and evict you. Enough talking. Let's fight. Let's. Just looking for one of those.
What are you looking at? Nothing. Well, it looks like you're looking at me, scumbag. Like I said, nothing. Oh, come on. I don't want to fight you. My name's Jimmy. Zoe. I was at Bullworth once. I got kicked out. Why? Let's just say Mr. Burton is a dirty creep. Seriously? I would love to teach that guy a lesson. He bullies everyone. You know, he goes jogging every day and regularly uses the porta potties in the park. Yuck. Yeah. So if we could catch him in one on top of a hill, then Mr. Burton could have a really interesting time in it. Yeah, but they're all chained together. We'll need to get some bolt cutters. Go get some from the Spaz Industries building and meet me at the park. Make sure no one sees you.
Oh my god! Corn! I didn't have corn for dinner! Oh, this is awful! Oh, 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 oh. God damn, I stink! I'm gonna have to shower for days with bleach! Ah, this is worse than when I got hazed! Nice work, Jimmy. Fun part of so far. Give up now, my shirt is getting dirty. has informed me of some drawings in the boys' washroom. Apparently, the sense of detail shows real promise.
Excellent, Jimmy. Mind if I... Well done, Jimmy. You completed all your assignments. If you'd like to come back to work on your skills, you're very welcome. You better be taking notes! I always knew I could do it. Better run, weak sauce. I really, really, really need some help. Okay, now all we gotta do is get you back more to the library. On. Hey, you're gonna find that you be was any more stupider. You guys can be real chuck. That sure is. Work. Uh, never mind. Is you really make me want to be nice to you. Hello. You have been to the nice carnival? to see you. Nice shoes. You Let's really make out. You need to get better with your shoes. <laughs> Does the shirt Hey, if you're nice to me, I'll make out with you. You know, you've impressed me, girl. Sorry, but I have to go study. I make myself clear. Where's your uniform, young Hulk? Can't you let me off just this once? Run along now, Jack. Here he is, Mr. Big. Yeah, it was you, creep. What was me? Don't play innocent with us. I tried that when Father caught me with Nanny. He gave me a good thrashing, and I've got half a mind to give you one. Hey, look, just get to the point. Someone stole our boxing trophies, buddy. They were heirlooms. Well, it wasn't me, rich boy, so relax. Well, if it wasn't you, then who was it? I bet it was those grease balls. I know it. They've always hated us. And so much for peace in our time, Popper. Just great. Let's get them. Yes. It's time to teach those poor, disrespectful scum a lesson. Wait, relax. Maybe it wasn't them. Maybe it was someone else. Nobody hates us. Apart from them. Oh, yeah, they do. Everyone hates you. You're all awful. Oh, la-dee-da. Now he tells us. You are pathetic, Hopkins. You're not a leader. Out of my way. Come on, men. Let's go. Okay. It's war. Hold on. Wait here. I'll go get your trophy back from those grease balls. Oh, man.
Vance. Did you guys steal the Preppy's trophies? No way, man. After the townie's been saying all that stuff about Lola and made Johnny crazy, we don't care about those stuck-up jerks. The townies? Really? Yeah, and Johnny says you're no friend of ours anymore. But since you got him out, I'll let you walk away from this meeting. Well, since I already beat you, I guess I believe you.
Well, Popper, what did you find? Yeah, who took our trophies? Don't tell me. It was the Tooth Fairy. <laughs> yeah, either it was the Tooth Fairy or the Grease Balls. I wonder which one. Actually, trust fund babies. It was neither. It was those townies. Which townies? The ones who hang out by the factory. Them? Why would they steal our trophies? Don't talk crap, Hopkins. I'm not. I've got a picture to prove it. Why? They don't have any problems with us. Yeah, poor kids just love rich kids who act like stuck-up jerks, don't they? Listen, you over-fortunate numbskull. They did everything. Put Johnny Vincent in the home, let the rats out of the library, everything, including your trophies. Why? Because I listened to Gary. So it is your fault. No, it was Gary's fault. You, my friend, have got delusions of grandeur. Nobody cares about you or Gary. You're ridiculous. Come on, Biff. Let's leave this king of this school to his pathetic little fantasies. You are an idiot, Hopkins. I've got a photograph. You know what you can do with that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy Hopkins delivers.